Hi everybody, welcome to Boxing Time. On this channel you will learn a lot of news from the world of boxing. So here we go. In a rumored fight card on December 9th, Keith Thurman will challenge WBA regular welterweight champion Imantis Stanionis. Danny Garcia will take on WBA secondary middleweight champion Eris Landy Lara on Showtime. Dan Raphael is reporting the potential Thurman Stanionis Garcia Lara fight card on December 9th on Showtime PPV. Apart from Stanionis, these guys are long in the tooth and pretty well past it. The 40-year-old Eris Landy Lara holds the WBA secondary 160 pounds title, but only because he fought Thomas Lamana to win the vacant strap. If Lara fought someone good, he'd likely fall apart like an old car. The event date conflicts with DAZN's Devin Haney vs. Regis Progrice PPV at the Chase Center in San Francisco. Maybe Showtime has stopped caring about competition for viewership at this point because it doesn't make sense to stage their old-timers event on the same night as Haney Progre. This rumored fight card is one of the three final cards on Showtime before they stop showing boxing at the end of the year. Stanionis, 14-0, 9 KOs, is a tough opponent for the 34-year-old former WBA WBC. Welterweight champion Thurman, 30-1 with 22 knockouts, to be fighting after his long layoff. As he's not seen action since last year in February, Thurman looked good in his last fight, beating Mario Barrios by a 12-round decision in February 2022. It's strange that Thurman didn't capitalize on that performance to fight one of the top contenders at 147 to position himself for a world title shot. Instead of doing that, Thurman sat inactive, calling out welterweight champions Errol Spence and Terence Crawford, thinking he would be given a free shot that he didn't deserve. Danny Garcia, 37-3 with 21 knockouts, arguably has more left in the tank than Thurman Lara, but it's a big reach for him to be fighting at 160. Garcia started his career at 140 and was considered small for the 147 pounds division when he moved up in 2016. In Danny's last fight, he came off a two-year layoff to defeat Jose Benavides Jr. by a 12-round majority decision last July. Before that, Garcia lost to former WBC welterweight champion Errol Spence Jr. by a 12-round unanimous decision in December 2020. Lara, 29-3-3, 17 KOs, successfully defended his WBA secondary middleweight title last year in May, stopping Gary Spike O'Sullivan in the eighth round of a one-sided fight. O'Sullivan had done nothing to deserve a title shot, apart from being well-known to hardcore boxing fans. If Danny Garcia can handle Lara's power and cut off the ring on him, he's got a chance of winning this fight, but it won't be easy because he's undersized for this weight class. Subscribe, please like and comment. This is very important for the development of the channel. See you later.